just wants Kuzma to play within himself tonight, not try and do too much. As McGee wins the tip and James controls for the Lakers. James averaging 25 points per game as Doncic beats Powell for the game opening alley-oop. More effective as a facilitator early on. James sees a seam and lays it in. Doncic lost it. James controls it. Here comes James. Bradley, open corner pop is good. A time to operate still on the shot clock. Lakers riding a six-game winning streak as James gives it up. Kuzma, clean look, connects from three. Guys have to be able to knock down shots because when it matters most, they're going to be dead to take and make big shots. Oh, nice finish from James inside the strength. Although uh, I'm sure James and Doncic will do a much better job of that. <laughs> James spins and finishes. You're going to have to send two guys to him. Doncic fighting off Bradley, able to finish. Luka Doncic so strong himself. It's two of two from deep and another Mavericks turnover, their fourth of the quarter. James says, I'll take it myself. And hit. Points a little over halfway through the first quarter. I'm more impressed with the nine points that they've given up to the Mavericks. They have imposed their will physically, defensively. Hardaway Jr. hits a three. Like we have gotten all-star caliber production in the combination of those two players. As that jumper drops for Hardaway Jr. plus the foul underneath. Howard secures it out there with Rondo Caruso, Kuzma, and Caldwell Pope as Rondo watches Kuzma fly in for the finish. And favorite wherever he goes. Rondo hooks a pass. Good extra feed from Kuzma. And Caldwell Pope sinks for three. You do need to add something, but doesn't always mean you got to get rid of a, a, a valuable piece. He's a guy that can help them when it matters most. James, the 15-time All-Star, as Kuzma lobs it up to Howard for the flush. Doncic got denied by Howard. Marjanovic trying to clean it up, left it short. The follow, no. How about another try? That'll get it done. Kuzma tried to go for the quick two for one. And now the Lakers will settle with seven on the shoot. Kuzma off. Howard just shedded Doncic. Points, six rebounds for Marjanovic. James lobbing it up to Howard, who got three underneath. We're used to, but we've certainly seen Dallas struggle with him out of the lineup. Where do they miss him most as James goes to work for another two? Incredible knowledge, system, and structure offensively. James step back three is good. And an excellent look at it from our incredible crew here in Dallas as Doncic works the foul, banks it in, and he'll have a chance for three. Particularly about their defense, and he said some not so safe for work language or stuff you'd want to say in front of the family about their defense. He was not happy at all. Dudley hits the three. Good guess. Doncic loves it up and Powell puts it down, puts the foul. For a year and a half was parading that Luka was the guy and it wasn't even close that they needed. He does things like that. Here's James around the Dudley screen. James puts it in, plus the foul. James motoring in, kicking out, Caldwell Pope, short. Who's with a put back? And that is an area where they struggle a bit. 20th in the league in offensive turnover percentage. Curry bangs in a three. The big five minute stretch for the Dallas Mavericks. They're going to have a chance. He's got to be take advantage during this run. DeLon Wright doing just that. A chance for three for DeLon Wright. Hardaway Jr. looking to create. Good D from Caruso. The tip is good. And it's tough to call, but I know you're going to force me to make a decision. <laughs> As Green hits a big three for the Lakers to end the 9-0 run. Right, lobbing it up. Good hands by McGee to deflect what could have been an alley-oop. Bradley bodies it up and in over Powell. 16-point Laker lead. 
Hardaway Jr., good look, and a hit from three. Certain teams that ended up passing on Luka Doncic. That sounds good. That's McGee. Fires it down after Doncic couldn't catch the lock. If you're Atlanta Hawks, you got Trey Young, you got a future guy that's there for a long time. But there's teams that, there were question marks about this guy. He's missed four of his last five, and those are big misses when you're trying to climb back into the game. And how about what he did after missing it? He ripped his jersey coming down the floor. Nine rebounds for LeBron James. James muscles in, couldn't glide it home, but Kuzma is there for the follow. The best way for them to claw back into this thing is possession by possession, but particularly starting in transition. They need to do a better job there. And of course, at that point, make them feel them. Because Cleveland's a knockdown shooter, so he gives him more room. That time came off where it could be a contest. Cleveland shooting 39% for three this season. And at times, but they're doing a great job of just forcing the issue and staying connected to him. It's like. You're too young to remember, but Muhammad Ali did that against the great George Foreman. Mm -hmm. Wore him down physically. It doesn't become a story because you can play LeBron James at the 4-5 or five and Kuzma at the 4, and then you have size, and the only guy they worry about is Boban would be the problem. 21 points, 11 rebounds, 7 assists. Doncic, the floater is good. James, the spin and the finish. The force and the finesse. But you see the difference. Luca with no big on the floor. I'm looking to turn the corner. That's exactly what he does and a chance for three. I mean, the help is LeBron James, and he can do it. James looking to isolate on Finney Smith. James turns the corner and lays it in. That's just too easy for LeBron James. Doncic with a seam, another tough finish. Hardaway Jr. kicks. Corner three, no. Hardaway Jr., the putback, yes. Has escaped him. Hardaway Jr., he got it. Dudley posting Seth Curry. Center of the lane. Dudley floats it in. Runs in. Jitters, kicks. Jackson hits from three. Five to shoot. Brunson looking for help. Nice cut from Curry in the finish. For the Lakers, 26-0 this year when leading after three, and that will help. He's requesting the timeout from David while the ball's being inbounded in the front court. So by the time David blew his whistle, here's James. James, step back, jumper, silky smooth. Here's James. The crossover and the reverse leg. LeBron James on autopilot. Hardaway Jr. faces the contact and puts it in plus the foul. He's made his presence felt since the minutes late in the 30 guy. Great tip by Caldwell. Pope and the finish. Seventh straight victory. Rondo from the elbow short. Sure. Does it on his turn. Knocks down the mid range. Think about getting Doncic and James out soon if you're the Mavs and Lakers, respectively. Oh, the Euro step and finish. Nicely done. And Dedekumbo to transition to Smart. Let me ask you, when you just look at the two teams with the best records in the NBA right now, the Lakers and the Bucks. And that will do it. An impressive, authoritative, seventh straight win for the Los Angeles.